Scorpios, since I brought you guys your last reading last time, I had to redeem myself. So this is this will be your love reading for May 4th to the 15th. So you have here the Ace of Wands. Okay. You have here the Queen of Wands. You have here the Three of Swords. And you have here the Four of Wands. So what I'm seeing here is that something ended in order for you to get this new beginning here. Um, something could have ended with you and your partner. Um, I also feel like there was some type of heartbreak here. Could have been due to a third party situation or you might have been in a third party situation or they could have been in a third party situation here. I feel like you might be dealing with someone here who's married already. Okay. And interesting. Um, I feel like you've walked away from someone that you've known for eight years um, or so. Maybe you've been married for eight years or this person been married for eight years. Um, this is your soulmate here. I feel like um, you're going through some type of transition, transformation. Don't we always go through transformation and transitions? Um, I also feel here that you're needing to tame yourself. And you're needing to have strength at this time. When this occurred, um, you needed strength. Um, also, I feel like this is some type of spiritual connection here as well um, that you have with this person. Okay? I also feel like maybe some of you are dealing with an Aries. I think Aries received that as well. I also feel that there was the fast communication is going to be coming in during this time. Um, I feel like this is someone who's holding on to their values, okay? Maybe because they feel like um, that means a lot to them. I see here where you're going to be uh, getting some exciting news that's going to be coming in if this is pertaining to work. I feel like you're going to be getting exciting news on that. If this is pertaining to love, I feel like you're going to get a new beginning. Um, someone is here is trying to offer you passion, a new beginning with passion. And also, I feel like they want to also be intimate with you, Scorpios. Ooh. Um, give me a clarification card. The three of Swords. I also feel like this. you are the fire sign right now. Okay. Location on three swords. So I feel like um you're taking action right now, Scorpios. You're not uh, I feel like maybe you were in a stagnant position, but now you're no longer in a stagnant position. Or I feel like you might have been looking at things in a different perspective, or the person you're dealing with was looking at things in a different perspective here. Okay, give me a break. Thank you. Yep, there was an ending. Someone here might have felt stabbed in the back. So maybe you felt stabbed in the back by someone here. I feel like there's going to be fast communication coming in. Um, someone here got stabbed in the back. Maybe um, a, a Libra, a Aquarius, Gemini individual stabbed you in the back. Or um, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries individual stabbed you in the back. But I feel like you, was, you felt stabbed in the back. Maybe because of a third party situation here. Or... Um, Either you were stabbed in the back or you might have been completing a cycle here. I also feel like um, some of you might be having, some of you guys need to literally check your backs. I feel like some of you guys might have back pains. Um, you might not be sleeping well at night as well. Um, you guys should get your rest. You need to sleep. Um, this is speaking to me too because I'm, I'm still up. It's after one in the morning. Um, I also feel like there's, there was an ending here. Maybe you ended something with an air sign, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini individual. Could have also been a fire sign. Leo, uh, uh, tongue tie. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. And I feel like if you're not dealing with a Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, I feel like there's going to be a new beginning with this situation. I feel like maybe things were stagnant before. Maybe you had a stalemate before. Maybe things were not moving forward. Or maybe you felt stuck in this situation. And I feel like 
there's going to be movement, some type of movement here um, with communication, fast communication coming in. Okay, within seven hours, seven days, or seven months, or seven weeks. Okay, there's going to be communication. I, um, I feel like it's seven days, though. Within seven days, you're going to receive communication, fast communication with this person. I feel like um, this could be someone that the person that's married. I feel like it's, it's a fire sign here. I see a lot of fire. Yep. This is someone who is in and out. Um, this person doesn't stay still. They're in and out of a situation, in and out of a marriage, in and out of your life, you know. Um, this person, it could also mean that this, this is a one-night stand as well. I did say that in and out. I did say that, Scorpios. So give me clarification for the four of wands. What is the four of wands here? Some of you guys might have also been in a relationship, a committed relationship. Your things ended. You guys were going through an ending of a phase. I think Aries also got this. So some of you guys are dealing with an Aries or an Aquarius here. I just said it. Uh, Libra or Gemini. So I feel like um, this was you guys' wish. Um probably to get married to this individual uh maybe you hope you hope that you get married to this person you wish that you get married to this person you want commitment with this person this was this is your wish and hope and you, some of you guys might be dealing with a star or maybe you guys are the star i also feel like some of you guys might be receiving messages through instagram twitter facebook emails um text messages calls okay it's going to be coming fast like it's mecca retrograde okay so i feel like there's someone here that wants to offer you stability okay and security here and i feel like this could be a taurus virgo capricorn individual here that wants to offer you something new yep this is someone that's known by a lot of people. A lot of people know them, and they know a lot of people. Um, I feel like this person might come in to stroke your ego, okay? I feel like someone's ego is being stroked here, um, or you might have been stroking their ego. Um, and I feel like this person is a star on internet, like social media star. Um, maybe this is you, Scorpio. Um, you guys want commitment, whoever this, um, earth sign individual is a fire sign, or this could just be your, um, energy coming in here. But I feel like you wish for this earth sign individual here. Um, and you want to get married to them. You want to have a commitment with them. You want them to offer you commitment. And I feel like that is going to happen because there's going to be victory in this situation here. So whatever you manifest is going to come into fruition. Whatever you wish for is going to come into fruition, okay? Pertaining to this situation, pertaining to this connection, pertaining to this person. It might be earth or fire. Girl, you know I, I, I love you. They might have felt like you might have been in a third party situation or you might have felt this way about them. Okay? Pertaining to location. Um, Ten of Swords. Mm -hmm. Give me clarification. Ten of Swords. Ten of Swords. Wow! Look at that. This person felt like you stopped them in the back because of a third party. You had a third party situation or they had a third party. Whomever you're dealing with might have a third party situation going on here. Um, this person is dating more than one person here because this showed up twice here. Okay, that's why you might have felt like you were stabbed in the back or they might have felt this way about you. Let's read card. Um, three of swords. And some of you are dealing with an emperor. Emperor. 
Okay? Someone who likes to be in charge. Someone who likes to be in control. This person could have been in the military, in the Air Force, Navy, Army, all those stuff. And I feel like they this person is very structured. This person, there's an age difference here. Okay? So some of you are dealing with an Aries. Some of you are dealing with a um, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. I feel like Libra, Aquarius, Gemini is your energy, Scorpio. And I feel like um, some of you guys might be dealing with a Leo, um, Aquarius, Taurus, Aries. Okay? I see all those signs here. So Leo, Aries, Taurus, Aquarius, Scorpio. Yep. A fixed sign. <laughs> I feel like there's a new beginning approaching with you and this person. Okay? There's a new beginning here approaching. I feel like if you're dealing with an air sign woman here, I feel like this person wants you to approach them with the truth. I mean, I, I'm i sorry. If you're dealing with an um, air sign individual here, um, and is a woman, I feel like this person wants you to step up with the truth. Um, don't come, come up with no BS or she'll cut you. If you're dealing with a male here, if you're a male here, you're dealing with a male here, I feel like this person wants to be in control of the relationship. Okay? And he's an Aries, okay? Um, so I feel like there was an ending that's going to bring a new change um, and a new beginning. Someone here wants to speak their truth. Someone here wants to speak. They want to, but their truth is not tactful. You understand what I mean? Like, um, they have something to say. They want to say something. Um, this could be your, your partner's energy here. Okay, you could be dealing with someone who's married. Um. I ain't no judging here. I don't judge nobody on what they do. Everybody grown, right? Scorpio. Love reading for me. 14 to 15. Everybody grown. So I feel like there's going to be victory in this situation. I feel like there's going to be new beginning. Um, you wanting them to speak the truth. You wanting them, um, no matter how hard the truth is, you want them to talk to you. So you might be thinking like your partner has a third party going on. And you want them to speak the truth to you. Okay, because you feel like there's temptation. There's a temptation here. Um, also, Scorpio, I feel like you guys are very spiritual too as well. Um, some of you might actually own a dog or a cat. Could be a um, black, white cat with green eyes or something like that. Okay? I also feel like um, there was a tower moment. At some point, okay, maybe something unexpected happened here, Scorpio. Um, some news or unexpected event. Something you did not expect happened here, okay? Um, <laughs> Scorpio. So this is you guys' gift. I didn't do nobody else. Oh, these three cards wanted to come out, so I'm just going to. Okay, so you guys have here walking away. So you walking away from things that no longer serves you when it comes to relationship here. Um, you have the door of personal healing and happiness. I feel like at this time you guys are going through um a personal change in your life, and I feel like um spirits are guiding you at this time. Do not be surprised if you see some type of dove around you. I also feel like um there's happy times coming in. Um, I feel like you guys are going through some type of spiritual growth here, and it might be concerning an earth sign here, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, individual, and this is someone who's a boss, okay, this person is fine, um, this person have their own coins, okay, they might be a boss, a supervisor, um, this person might be known by a lot of people speaking public, um, this person here is trying to offer you some type of stability here. Um, but I feel like you walk, it's almost like you're walking away from one situation into another, 
or you might have walked away from this earth sign individual and you had to go through some type of healing to get to your happiness, which is this person. Okay? Scorpio, that's what I have for you. Um, don't forget to like, share, comment, um, and subscribe. Thank you guys so much for your support. I appreciate you all and I love you. Thank you for your patience. Au revoir.